so hello everyone welcome to my new video of the essay problem series the previous five videos are in playlist on the channel tag on sky so let me start this video so this is the problem number six problem number six which is huge side leg so this is the description of this problem what is description there are n trucks from number one to n okay there are n trucks from one to n the trucks are coming on the road in a random manner what mean by random random means in the in any order not sorted what mean by random random mean mean any order like first two is coming then four then one then one then three then six then five this is the random order there is a side lane which can be used to order the sequence of truck, pro pro truck properly if it is possible to achieve using side lane print yes else print no it means from the description we understand that one road there are n trucks from one to n are coming on the road in a random manner like first come two then come three then come one then come five then come six if i take n equals to seven then come like we can take four then come seven so this is the random order in which trucks are coming so and one side lane is given to me side lane means we have to use like we can understand through stack like we take an stack as a side lane okay so we have to use the side lane and if this is possible that we can arrange the trucks in n one to n manner it means if we if if by the using side lane if we arrange the trucks from in one to n manner in this in order manner one two then three then four on on the road if we can arrange in this then we have to print yes and if this is not possible so we have to print no it means there are two type of output if this is possible that all trucks are in order so this uh, we print yes and otherwise we print no so i hope the description is clear we take sample input to more understanding so this is the input pattern and the constants are 10 to the power 3 it means if we have used brute force approach it is also accepted okay so yes n equals to 10 to the power 3 it means our brute force approach is also get accept, accepted now come on the sample input to more understanding so this is sample input there is two types of possibilities of output one is if we have achieved the order 1 to n on the road using side lane so we print yes otherwise we print no so let me take one sample input and explain this 5 1 4 2 3 so this is the sample input in which n value is 5 and this is the order which is given to me of the trucks okay this is random order now we have to if i have achieved this order 1 2 3 4 5 using side lane so i print yes and otherwise i print else i print no okay so this is the idea overview of this question okay. so now let me draw a side lane so our side lane looks like a stack okay so, and this is our road so i take one first of all i have to arrange in the let me change i have to arrange in one to n order so my first expected truck is one if i get one number truck i just put on road otherwise i use the side lane and put the truck on in side lane so my first truck is the five so this is not equals to one i just put this into our side lane so this truck is putting in side lane now come on this truck yes this is my expected this is equal to one so i just put this truck on the road okay now the my expected is increasing by one my now my expected is two so this is also second number truck i just put this on road okay now my expected truck is third but i get four so i just use side lane and put this into side lane now my expected truck is three and this is also equals to three yes so i put my this on three now the array is complete but I have to check the stack that in stack now my expected is four if the top of stack it means in the side lane the truck on top is the four number so and then my expected both are equal so i just put four on the road and pop from here now my expected is five so i just take five from the stack because in in side lane we have five number truck so we just put on road and pop from here so now my stack become empty it means i have and i have arranged all trucks from one to n on the road so i get one to n order of these trucks using this side lane so just i print yes it means the output for this sample input is yes okay so i hope the question is clear that what question see now like we understand one example of no so we take this example so one three five two four now i just briefly explain this example we use side lane okay first one number truck is coming yes i required one number just i put on the road now my expected is two number but this is three i use side lane put this in three now my expected is two but this is five just i put in side lane okay now my expected and this is equal so i just put on the road now this is four and i my expected is the integer by one because two is completed now my expected is three but this is four so just put in this now once the array is completed check the step check the side lane in side lane the first number truck is the four so which truck is coming outside four but this is not my expected so here we just print no that not possible to arrange the trucks in one to n order so the output for this problem is no okay so the now this sample input give me this output so now i hope that question is clear now i talk about approach so from this uh, like if i take one example five two one four three 
I do not know that what is the output. I just un explain the approach what I have used. So first of all, I take one variable which is called the expected truck. Expected truck. Okay. So this is initially this is one, and uh, this value is going till n. Okay. So this is in starting this is one because I have required first number truck. So first I check complete array. I traverse in the array. I traverse in the array and check that if my array element, if my array element is equals to equal to my expected truck, it means what I have to do. I just increase my expected equals to one. Okay. And if this is not else means this is not equal to expected. So what I do? I just put in our stack. I take one stack in initially and just put this stack dot push this array of i and i do not have to increase expected this ex expected on this else condition okay so this is both two conditions which is normal okay so now when i i have to check we we see in this example when i come when i like i have to check every time in step that if this is present in our side lane or not so like in starting what i have checked that why our stack length is not equals to zero this is for only the while loop don't get error because when I access this stack top, if I do not write this condition, the while loop may be getting, maybe give me some error, which is list index out of range. So what I do not equals to zero and the stack top, if this is equal to my expected, while this is equal to my expected, what I do just increase expected and stack dot pop. Okay. So this is the idea. Now, if I like this is the visualization, like you can see that this is my output 5 2 4 3 so first you can see that one number is going on five number on side line then this is the order remains now two number going on then three then four number comes in the side line then three number and four number going then five number so this is the visualization which helps you to understand more now if i write coding part so this is, i write uh, some pseudo code type code so i write in python language you can convert in any language which you prefer so i first first i create a function define fun define function what is our function name our function name is huge side line and one n and one rh passing in the function so first what i take we take one step it means this is our what is this is our side lane okay now i take one expected expected truck expected truck number which is initially this is one okay so first i run a loop or i in range n from zero to starting from n and taking one step every time i check here i check two conditions if our array of i means our array element is equals to equals to our expected expected truck number so what I do, I just increase this expected truck number by one. Okay. And if this is not equal to, so what I do, I just push on our stack. Stack dot push. You can in Python you can use append. Stack works at array list. So use append and stack dot append arr of i. Yes. So this is now when I we understand in sample inputs that when we comes first, we have to check the side lane. If in side lane this expected truck is present, so for this we have first check that if this is present on stack or not. So I check the while length of stack not equal to zero. Why I write this condition for to prevent from the error. So by end, if our stack top element, while our stack top element is equal to equal to expected, expected truck number. If this is condition is true, so what I do? First I increase the expected truck number from one, then I just Stack dot walk. I hope this code is clear till now. Then one condition is remaining that in last, if all like we see in this example, after completing loop, the five and four number truck, like if in we can see in visualization, when the loops is completed, the four and five number is in our side lane. And we have to take one one value and check that is this is equal to expected. Yes. So we just increase both and we check this side lane. If it is possible that side lane become empty, so we are print yes, otherwise you print no. So what I do, I just completing after while loop, I check while length of step is not equal to zero and stack of peak if this is equal to equal to i just copy this and paste it here so this is to end if after this if our length of step it means if our stack becomes empty so we have achieved our we have achieved our order so we just print according to question we have print yes and else we print no. sorry we use function so we just write if length of stack is yes then return otherwise return no okay return yes so this is the complete code, not a pseudo code, this is a real code in Python language. So that's all about this problem. Use side lane. Thanks.